that one's all right. The rest. I'm one? gonna drive the fent. You're gonna get that one. Okay, I'm gonna go for this one. And none of these are modded. I just colored a tractor and I colored the. Oh, drive control on. Yep. Okay, so yep. Should I lead since I know where I'm going? You yeah, should. sure. Okay, well, first thing, let's go over and see the shop. Okay. The shop is sort of somewhat working. Whoops, whoops. Kind of turned too fast. Oh, you left the old shop textures in too. Nice. Yeah, I figured it's all working, so why change it, right? I think I still need to... I have to redo the areas markers, but the actual shop itself works. This is the same shop from 15. Isn't it? Yep. Or something similar. Very similar, yeah. It's got the cardboard cutouts inside. That's awesome. Yep. How'd you guys get over there so fast? Oh, you went that Floor way. Floor it. Right. Or just go the right way. Wait, I went the wrong way. That's, that's what I do. Okay, every all the uh, shop stuff yeah. seems to be fine. Yeah, and you can customize your vehicle. That glitch that's in Sosnovka is not in this one. Uh, I reinstalled and it works fine now. Oh, okay. You'll see that if you watch tomorrow's episode. Oh, okay. I've been map yeah. editing, so I'm behind in my. I said tomorrow's episode. <laughs> Here's the, here's the fuel station right here. Yep. That should work, but if you warp to it, you end up stuck in the middle of your the, the gas tank. Um, yep. Yeah. So don't do that. Alright, so let's go over this way. I need to straighten out. There we go. Yeah, me too. Oh dear. My, oh. my camera's all cockeyed, so then I was trying to drive and then, like, ended up on the, the side of the sidewalk and all kinds of crazy stuff. I think we left Maze behind. Hang, hang yeah. We should have just did follow me and let her just, uh, her, her worker drive her around. Um, yeah. How'd you get there? And just took the road. So see, this is a nice shed and a fuel spot too. So yeah, see, I like this. I like the uh, shed, these sheds right here, the big ones. Another fuel point. There's a lot of fuel yep. points. Yep. And here's the cell point once she gets it fixed and working. Where's the cell point? The, the over by the shop. gas station. The farm shop. <laughs> oh, that's a cell point. Yeah. I was looking for good cell well, points. Oh, wait for you to get here. Okay. Yeah, I like the big vehicle I know. bays. These are great. I know this map. I like it in the new textures, with the new grass and the rock textures and uh, the trees. No more helpline, I realize that. The, the phone helpline doesn't work. Okay, did you fall in that one? No? No. Oh, yeah. Okay, this one I'm going to leave as is. This one's all right. Yes. Okay. No round for okay. that one. So this is where you, you're working at. That's over here at the port. Hey, Nilfix, how you doing? Oh, Nilfix. Hello, Nilfix. Thanks for following me on Twitch. <clears throat> I never noticed that before. Mm. The little birdhouse type thing there. Oh, it's cute. Now this is a huge field, brother. Yeah. I think it's the one that I was talking about. Yeah, it is. This is another cell point. And you're going to make all these cranes work, you said, Mace? Yes, I <laughs> want to connect the cranes, like, with the working cranes in FS17. I'm going to import those from the other map into this one. And connect this to the railway station this will be a stop on the rails i just i just i just drove across that really easy now you might be able to keep that one too 
Oh, is it the cell tree? Okay, I think I know what the problem is. Okay. I can drive across this. I'm doing pretty good. We're checking out this new map. Uh, Maze has been uh, working hard <laughs> trying to convert this over to uh, FS17. We wanted to have something unique uh, for our people to look at and watch us do and we figured uh why not have a better a new map and Dornal loves this map so he convinced Maze to to work on it and she did and that's a weird graphical glitch of like grass but in my peripheral vision that yeah, might be... you're getting some of that oh is that standard with this map no no i think it's standard with just the game Oh, okay, because it might I've, I've be... I've heard people talk about it on the on the forums. Oh. Did you see the water grim? In the, in the I did. And stuff? And the trains on the port? Oh, okay. I love this. This, this is just okay, one of so my favorite spots. Yeah, this is the freight yard. It looks like you did some work here. I tried, but I kind of left it for now. I said I was really short on time. I've only been really in the meat of this for a couple of days. So, so in, in 2013, you had to pull up here next to it, and you had to be able to side tip, and you tilted into the train cars, and that's how you sold. Right. That's why I, I kind of was like, okay, I'm going to just leave that for later, um, but I really want to have the trains working, so that's going to be different, maybe? Changed a bit. Nice. Yeah. I really do want to update that. I think it's going to make this map, like, just even better <laughs> I also figured out I think I can quickly replace the trees so all the trees could be available for lumber as well oh you can do like a search and replace there is a replace function it's just the trees are multi-part because some like the, it's the model and then there's the the rigid body it's two different things so it doesn't replace them both at once it's a little bit tricky but I might be able to finagle it <laughs> what I'm just going to drive backwards. <laughs> anyway. Yeah. Go ahead and turn around. We're going to go over this way. Moving right along. So you know about that over there. So I ain't got to show you that. The tippy this thing? Is just, yeah. Yeah. Bringing back so many memories. So is that golf course still down there? Or yep. did you already do that? Okay. We'll yeah. see it. I didn't really so. mess with the terrain too much. I said, I've been working at the underpinnings and trying to get all the models in without having errors. Like, you were able to load it without your server giving you errors. I'm like, hee <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Well, I was just wondering if, like, this map dynamically updates or how you how they do the maps is my, my question. How they do the maps. Um... Yeah, like if you were to get rid of that golf course to put the pigs down there or whatever it was that you were talking at one point, would that dynamically update or would it still look like it's the golf course down there? On the PDA? Yeah. Yeah, that's the, no, it would not update. The, it would graphically. Mm, so look you'd have to do something yourself. I have to go in the editor and fly way, way, way up high and take a screenshot. That's how that map was made. Oh, okay. The little markings on it are dynamic, but the actual graphics, like the, the imagery, is, is static. Okay. Hey, Moises Santos. Welcome. Hello. And now we're at the biogas plant. This is what I wanted to ask you guys about. I do kind of like this plant, but I can replace the plant completely with the one from 17, or I can replace components. Components. Yeah, just the components. Like, put the scale in. Yeah, the scale for sure. Um, the bunkers, I'm scared because of all the glitches. Um, He's... Yeah, um, leave the leave the bunkers. Um, I want to see how the cow uh, one works. I'll have to give a test to that. I'm thinking that these bunkers will probably work better than the ones in 17 because they're different, right? Watch, like, let me see if I can get on top of these. But ones. I'm not even sure if they work at all, is what I'm saying. They might not, because all of the triggers and everything's handled differently now. So. Oh, you don't have triggers in them yet? No. 
Well, 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 yeah, the triggers are in from the old map, but I haven't put them in from 17 because there isn't really. They're, they're all in the XML file. It's weird. Um, I was kind of leaving okay. that one until a bit later. Um, okay. Um, this here maze, you might want to replace with the red uh, stand-up one, like the one in, uh, seven, in Goldcrest. Yeah. Or, or we could leave it just like that. What is this? Is this the uh, silent cell point? Yep. Oh, I like it like this. I kind of like this one better, but... Yeah, we can tip right into it. Back yeah. into it. Yeah. Tip, the side tip. Now, it could be just my laziness talking, but I do appreciate this design a bit better. Um, but, I mean, it was. I figured I'd leave it up to you guys, whatever you prefer. Um, yeah, you're going to have to definitely update the trigger, because before, you could only dump into it with a um, bucket. You couldn't tip into it. It wouldn't let you. Oh, I see. It only has it a always bucket. Had to, it always had to be a bucket, yes. Okay. Alright, I'll, okay. I'll pull in the same kind of trigger from 17, but I'll keep the model like this. That'll work. Okay. I do like it on the ground like that. Yeah, I much prefer this. I mean, you could still do conveyors if you wanted, but... If you could just dump in there with your tipper, it would make it so much easier. We have to buy the conveyors for your your potatoes and beets. You know? Oh, where does the um, oh, what is it called? Uh, when you sell silage, it becomes a type of fertilizer that you can use. Yes. Yes. Where is that? What is that called? I can't remember. Is that so over it, here? It's yeah. It's this tank over here. Okay. Now, I will say let's replace this tank with the one from 17 because it has the uh, fill point. Okay. That fill point trigger. All right, one sec. I want to make uh, a couple of notes here. Hey, I'm always just uh, welcome. From my, I'm sorry, I don't know any uh, Spanish or Portuguese. Or I would, uh, I'd say, hola, that's about it. <laughs> I don't even know how to say it in Portuguese, so <laughs> that's about all you can get from me. I know a couple swear words, but I don't want to say those. Shame on you. <laughs> I live in Arizona. That's all, all the only Spanish that we need to know are swear words. Okay, and I would also say let's bring in the scale from 17, or from Goldcrest, because I like that scale. This is just a slab of concrete. Okay, so doesn't give scale. you any numbers. New scale, new fertilizer tank. Um, old silage cell with new trigger. Okay. Because I don't want to forget anything. I've been coding for too long. My brain is a bit mushy. So I'm going to write things down. Developing. Now remember, the, the trigger from 17 doesn't allow you to tip into it either. How about that? Really? Yeah, they won't let you tip silage into it. That's so why we had to get the conveyors. So we're going to have to get the conveyors. Well, um, there was a mod that I used in Old Family Farm that allowed me to... It was a uh, placeable silage cell point, and it had a trigger in that in that would allow you to yeah. uh, So basically what it. he's asking for me is a, is a typical... Point. In 15, you could tip into the one in 15, because I got a, a placeable ramp, and I just drove up and tipped into that, and it was fine. Okay. So, um, I know how to add tip triggers. That was what I was okay. fighting with that kind of kept the stream delayed. It was the tip triggers had collision. I don't know why. Because um, the meshes transferred over, because they're the same shape. I don't know what the heck. But anyway, I learned a lot about tip triggers. I did. So. All right, you guys ready to move on? Yes. Sure. Before I go into too much techno babble. Now this plant has two uh, two entrances and two exits. Gracias, Moses. Actually, it has three. I should I should get Eskin here. He, he speaks Spanish, right? <laughs> um, actually, I think he speaks Portuguese. Oh well, that's even well, that might even be better. Who knows? Oh, actually, you know. 
Or he was from Argentina. Yeah, it could be both. Yeah, All right. Over here. Did I lose Darnall, Darnall already? Oh, we're going. Just, yeah, just come over across the scale. Yeah, he, there's a back door entrance. There's three entrances to this way. There's three? Oh, oh yeah. yeah, one, two, and then the one over there. I like how this still works. The uppy downy thing. The bar. Oh, the bar, yeah. The animation of that works, which I'm quite happy. I so have to this is that. a cell point. This would be like the Denton Bakery, but this it's it's the inn here. And I drove across it just fine. Okay, so anything that doesn't have the updated tip trigger works. For some reason, the new collision mesh and the old collision mesh collide and you end up falling through or hitting a wall, one or the other. Okay. Good to know. So that's like the bakery? The inn? Yes, yep. Labeled? And this is, this is the RV park that we're going to eventually have a pig farm at. That that's very fitting. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. Oh, I love the tent though. We got to put the tent somewhere else. What tent? Oh, there's a bunch of tents. The, oh yeah, I see. Um, not the like pointed one, but the one with the little awning and stuff with the little uh, chairs on the outside. That's hilarious. There's another little area with a campfire, and I thought that I would move some of the cuter little parts. Oh, I like these. I thought it was cute. I don't want to lose the model, so I thought I would move them to another area that I spied a little campfire at, so um, so they wouldn't be completely gone. No, I like that. This we need one of these over by the farm. Okay, I need. It's to like see... per it's like perfect for um, putting like the lawnmower stuff in. Like this is the lawnmower shed. Oh, just that little one. Yeah. Oh, there's one at the right beside the house. Oh, is there? I can add a couple more if you like. Well, I was just thinking for uh, doing the, the mowing and stuff like that, having the mower, the tether, uh, and a wind rake maybe in there. I don't know. That might be too much. But at least the uh, mower and, and tether could go in there. Okay. Um, yeah. On farm. Especially if we get like a uh, a riding mower mod, that'd be hilarious. That there actually was one leave... in 2015 and 2013. They didn't mm -hmm. leave grass though, did they? They just mowed it. They didn't make because like... this was a, a mission area. This um, the area would pop grass and you mowed it down, and then there would be no grass. So it was just a mission area. But yeah, I thought I'd move some of All these right. cute tents. But do you think this is big enough for the pig farm? I think so. Yeah, or the new sheep farm? The new sheep farm is about yeah, the size. Yeah, I would hope so. Well, the sheep farm already has a place, right? Yep, and we're going to go see it. Uh, this map is not available to download yet. This is a preview. Uh, it's still being worked on. I'm working on it. <laughs> Just waiting for Maze. See, I'm slow. Everybody has to wait for me. Oh, I see the bridge is still there. Yep. Just I kept all of the models that I could. There's a few things missing, but they will be they will be added. I don't wanna take away from the map, I wanna add to it. Like I said it's hurting to, to take out the trailer part, but I have to, so I'm just gonna move a lot of the models. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, and you you gotta take out the golf course too, unfortunately. That there's no way to preserve. I can't move it because it's the actual train. And what is with this weird grassity grass stuff? Weird. Weird grass on the fields. It's not oh, the collusion. 
So we gotta actually keep the uh, golf course? No, uh, I was gonna turn it into the sawmill area, unless we could move yeah. a different area for that. No, 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 that's fine. The sawmill area would be great. Yeah, people won't need to golf. Well, it's completely useless. I'm guessing it was a mowing mission. It was a mow, yeah, mow mission area. Yep. But we, can, we can get the golf cart mod. I do love these trees. Like, I want to leave these big, awesome trees in here, for sure. Leave these trees, for sure. Because this is a design. Yeah, the only thing I'm going to replace is, like, the maple trees I'm going to replace with updated maple trees. Y you know what I mean? Like, I think these are... I'm not sure what these are. They're not maples. Yeah. <laughs> the stream is wow. neat. And the stream is actually different than the river. The water? actually looks different, which I thought nice. was, it was really well done. I just tried to make sure it stayed that way. And here's the golf course. Now, a couple things about the golf course in 2013. There used to be, you didn't know have a place to, to uh, get rid of grass if you didn't silage it. You could dump it into there's there was like huge bouldered areas you could dump grass into and it'd get rid of it for you. Where's the water? I thought there was water here. Ah. Maybe your water areas didn't fill in. Yeah. I'm I'm, I'm noticing that. Do you see those little blues? The blue clipping through the grass? That might be the water plane. Why is it not showing? Uh, well, I said this is going to go. This is going to be the larger pig farm. Because there's, there's a couple of fields by there and... Oh, I thought that was a sawmill. Sorry, sawmill. Sawmill. Right. In fact... See, I said my brain's getting mushy. I'm going to write down the okay, golf course. Sawmill. All right, we need to find a dirt bike mod because this place would be so much fun to, to like go this high speed with a dirt bike and like jumps and all kinds of like he's doing right now. <laughs> Just going down the, the mountain. It's hilarious. Doing buggies. In the pickup truck, you can do like Dukes of Hazard style. It's it's hilarious. <laughs> I yes, I need that. I need, I need the General Lee. Yeah, with the depth. This is, <laughs> this is the cow area. Oh, you guys left without me while I was making notes. Dang. You guys. Oh well, we're just we're at the cow area. You know where that's at. Uh, yeah. We'll wait here. We'll wait here for you. Mm -hmm. and there's your small silage pit for the cow. Yeah, so she'll have to see if she can get triggers and stuff like that. I do like these barriers better. And I'm wondering if these barriers would stop the silage from spilling into them, causing that issue that we were having. Well, they did in 2013. Yeah. Shortcut. Hmm. Come down the mountain like we did. Yep. Yeah. Me coming down the mountain when she comes. Yeah, I didn't import all of the cow stuff because I wasn't sure if we wanted old or new. I kind of figured Grim might like this, the, 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 the original bunkers, as he was saying. Because the they're almost exactly the same as the old family farm ones. So, um, and if they're less glitchy, but as far as like the tanks um, and all of that stuff... I don't know if we want old or new. Um, you may have to do new, just because of the new way and the new requirements to feed them. Yeah. It would be it, it would be less work to import the new stuff than to try and convert the old stuff. It would be because I don't right. have to do it from scratch. I could just like literally import the areas and have all of the information in there already. So. But 
yeah, I'm okay with that. We can. I'd, I'd like to, would have liked for it to stay that way, but if we got to change it, we got to change it. I can put everything where it, it was, just you know, like with the new tank. Francis Moses, well, welcome to the Grim Nation. We'll be uh, we stream every Thursday usually for Farming Simulator, and I have a a video up pretty much Monday through Saturday uh, doing different uh, FS17 things. So if you're into that, that's what I've got, and I've also have the um, Minecraft stuff on, uh, well, usually Monday through Friday, but right now I'm kind of focusing on getting my mod pack out. So just Tuesdays and Thursdays for Future's Edge, Lance Strider's mod pack, and then Monday, Wednesday, Friday will be the uh, the TFC stuff. So this ah, is I this love is, it, dude. This is I want I want this house on the old family farm somewhere. Can you do that? Yes. <laughs> what the whole huge mansion? Yeah, the hotel it looks like a mansion. This is where you sell the wool. Oh, at the spinnery? Yes, this would be the spinnery sell point. Wait for you to get here so you can see where it's at. Okay. I have an idea of what you're talking about. That is a nice place. Whoop, whoop. And I'm not falling down. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. Oh. I almost fell off the wall. Are you playing stunt tractor over there? Yep. She is. Oh. And you missed the turn. I did. Did you see She's that? She's going to end up like on top of the church. <laughs> Somehow. Okay. I totally missed it the wrong way, so I'm going to come around the wrong way. Let me get out of her way. You better. Yeah, we... <laughs> okay. You want this gigantic so thing that's in the old gonna be the... farm? Yeah, kind of like a lordly estate somewhere. Not like in the at, at the farm, but just like is it, somewhere. Is it going to take up half the map? Probably. The but I got plans. The town? <laughs> yeah, like, I mean, the town has to be completely redone. It's it's mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a mess. Oh, that's, that's a good idea. Hold on. Um, yeah, we could do a German style town that might be easier for you to import those buildings. Well, I was looking Not really on German style, but like this building here. Well, the Sosnovka map had some neat little houses too that were like okay. kind of. That works too. But I mean, I could do a blend. It really doesn't uh, matter too much. Like right. if you like this, then we could go for that. I'll make a note. Well, to me, it looks like a really big estate that you might see in like North Carolina. That's why I was looking at it. And like, if it was off in like in the corner, just as looks, no functionality near it or anything, but just kind of like a lordly, like plantation estate. Yeah. You got you got the, your notes for here. Yep. Okay, let's move on. Okay. So this. Now, is I know Nilfix going to ask: um, Is this going to be console available, or are you going to have? Are you going to try to be able to release it on the consoles as well? Um. So far, the only thing with the script, I think, is those gates. So. Bye, I'm, Moises. I'm not sure. Oh, bye. Oh, wow. Uh, this is the grass you were talking about growing through the... Yes, and this is yeah. the cell point that I was able to fix. Oh, you wasn't able to fix it on the inside? No. You might fall through if you go in there, so I wouldn't. I wouldn't go in there if I were you. Just don't do it. Fall through what? <laughs> I was going to walk through. Oh, you can walk through. Walk through. Ah, giant pit of death. And now you're stuck. Forever. Yep. You fall. Yeah. And, oh, I thought there was a way out. Oops. <laughs> there is. It's called tab. Yeah. Yeah, you could use tab. Oh, I'm sorry. There you go. Okay. Yeah, so okay, that was so my big mess. My big terrible mess that I was pulling my hair up. But the ramp works hold on so i don't think that's a bad thing if we just use the ramp is there a way to close this off yeah how about is there a way to put the ramp inside that's what i was trying but when i did that you it was like you drove right into a wall so it's like it's probably those big lights at the top it 
could be. There's a trigger in there somewhere that, or some sort of collision body that is causing me so much grief. And, you know, like, I've been working on this all day, and it's probably something obvious that I'm missing. So, <laughs> tomorrow I'm going to look at it I'm again. looking out for you, Netflix. <laughs> Sorry, I'm talking to a comment on there. He said I asked the question before he was able to ask. I haven't decided yet if I want to try and get this onto the consoles or not. I love scripts, but I don't feel like they're necessary to have a good map. So, I mean, if people want it on the console, I should keep it without scripts. That that little uh, bar raising and lowering script, that could be removed. Doesn't have well, to is that a giant script? Because giant scripts are allowed. That is a giant script. Just not third party. Well, that's then that's good. fine. Then yeah, then this should be okay on the console. I don't intend on adding any scripts. Not to this map. Okay. Oh, whoa. Oh boy. Uh-oh. Are we having problems? Oh, I'm going to do it. Easy, there's something there that'll flip you. How do you get back up right? It just rolled over and went this way. <laughs> All right. Oh, this I like is... the ivy that's growing on the oh, side sorry. of that. Uh, yeah, the ivy's neat. bumper tractor. This is the sheep farm. Here was their trough for food, and you didn't have to give them water, so you're yeah, going to have to put in a place for water. I was going to put in the new sheep stuff, like if that's how it's going to go with um, like I think Grim's right to get it to work properly. I'm going to have to add the new stuff. So I'm going to have in the same locations, but um, it's all going to be uh, the new models. Okay. The sheep one should be fine because with the old one, uh, if you, but the new one's just, just as good. Um, the grass inside of here, uh -huh. um, if you do like the dirt paint brush to get rid of like the grass area, will that get rid of the, the grass through the yes. floor? Okay. That's just me going around and tidying things up, which I haven't okay. done. Yeah. yeah, that's the foliage layer where it shouldn't be why I don't know why but it's there and it will be gone soon because it drives me bananas so that's the map uh, this is pretty much everything oh yeah we've got foliage here in the, the field too <laughs> this is where yeah. you picked up your pallets by the way it was right here the wool cell trigger mm -hmm. no the, it was the pickup place where the wool was oh sorry the yeah where it spits out so that's yep. what I need to check about rotation and stuff. But like I said, I'm going to be importing this stuff from FS17 and I can add a rotation to it when I do. So yeah, this is a... Uh, it's looking good. Everything yeah. Is, so other than livestock things missing, everything's in place and looks all right. And we, we're not falling through all the cell points, which I was really afraid of. Well, like I said, it's a work in progress, and then hopefully every so often we'll have an update to the map and start doing more stuff. Like right now, uh, people who are watching may not under might not know, but uh, if I open up my map here, you'll see there's only three fields that are numbered. Those are the only three fields that are active right now. And so we have to wait for Maze to do the magic stuff to get the other fields going, but we, ha we own two of them. And if we get enough money, one day we'll be able to purchase another one. And then, as things go, we'll update the server with the map and fixes. And we'll, we'll take a little bit of a tour of the areas that she's improved and uh, continue on like that. And in my description.